Hi everyone, it's Tammy and it's time for another easy foodie Friday. And this is going to be something called Million Dollar Dip. And I'm going to you to dip Tostitos in it. So I have a bag of those. I also have a block of cream cheese, mayonnaise, cheddar cheese, bacon bits. I have some Fox Point seasoning because I love this, but if you have garlic, you can use that too. I also have about three uh, big green onions and that is it. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm just going to add about half of a block of cream cheese. I might end up adding the whole block, but I'm just going to eyeball everything. Um, I think I'm gonna do half a block though. I should have opened this to start, sorry. But this dip came to me um, from an email that I had received and I changed it up a little bit to make it more my taste and I made this once before and it was fabulous. So I'm thinking that it'll be just as good and I haven't made it with my changes. So I'm gonna try that with you guys. So let's see, half a block of cream cheese. And this is softened. And then I'm gonna use about a cup of mayonnaise. And again, I just like to eyeball everything. So I'm just eyeballing it. My lid on my mayonnaise is broken. Oops. And then I'm going to add probably about two or three pieces of bacon if I were to, to chop up my own bacon. I'm just cheating and using this uh, Oscar Mayer. I love this brand. Some of the brands I've tried have a lot of like fatty pieces in it and this doesn't seem to, so I like that a lot. And then I'm going to add about a cup of cheddar cheese. I'm gonna do another dip soon and I will use the rest of this for that. I'm going to be making a buffalo chicken dip that I think I will show you guys as well. And then as much seasoning as you want, I'm gonna say between a teaspoon and two teaspoons. And if you like more onion, use more onion. If you like less, use less. And the original recipe that I had called for almonds as well, but I thought that seemed kind of odd and I haven't put those in, so I'm not going to do that this time either. And you can obviously go down as far on the onions as you want. I don't mind the white part. Some people say that that's not very good, but honestly, I, I don't know. I like the whole onion, so I will often just use the whole darn thing. That noise you hear is my dog. Well, actually, it's my son's dog. Oh, no, that is my dog. And my cat. <laughs> okay, so now I'm just going to mix all of this together and see if I need to add more creaminess or if it's good. It's almost like a cheese ball, I think. I think you could probably make it into a cheese ball if you wanted to. Oh no, this looks perfect. Oh my goodness, this looks amazing.
Make sure your hands are clean before you do that, of course. I'm gonna wash them again. And that is all you need to do. That's all she wrote. So let's try this and see how it tastes. Mmm. How quick and easy is that? And it is as good as it sounds. Oh, it is good. Mmm. -hmm. I hope you guys try it and I hope you love it. Thanks for watching. Bye.